Well, guys, no details on the names of these two men, their hometowns, or where they died, but the medical director of the State Department of Public Health tells me the situation's unusual because of the age of these two men, between the ages of 40 and 60. That's relatively young, and also because it's still so early in the season. Sometimes it hits in, in October. Sometimes the first cases don't get here until December. The approximately 50 Unity Point clinics and urgent care centers in central Iowa have seen a combined 28 cases of influenza since the 1st of October. Not a large number considering the state sees some 300,000 cases each year. But we have a head start along with Oregon and Rhode Island as the three states that currently have the highest influenza activity. If you are at all wavering, please get the vaccine. At the Unity Point Clinic in Norwalk, there are 300 doses of flu shots on hand, but no flu mist doses. The clinic manager says they usually have about 500 doses on hand this time of year and hopes to get another delivery within the week. The flu mist manufacturer had a problem with the manufacturing of it and therefore had to modify something. And whatever that modification is has delayed the shipping out of the vaccine. State epidemiologist Patty Quinless says there have been outbreaks in eastern Iowa, but influenza so far has not been widespread. But it's coming. And especially now that we've had deaths in central Iowa, bottom line is the flu is here and it's going to get worse. And if you've not gotten your flu shot yet, now is the time to go get it. A flu, uh, flu numbers can spike, as we all know, after the holidays with everyone traveling. Dr. Quinlis told me this afternoon, do not wait to get vaccinated. She says if you get vaccinated uh, today or tomorrow, you actually will have a pretty good immune immunity built up by Thanksgiving. Reporting live in Des Moines, Mark Tauschak, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader.